Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The celebration of 90th anniversary of Indian Air Force Day has been special for many reason. This was the first time when Indian Air Force Day event was moved out of the national capital to Chandigarh. The main highlight of the event was the new camouflage uniform of the Indian Air Force which was unveiled during the event. The thumb rule of engagement in war is stealth and concealing. You don't let your enemy see you before you see him. The enemy might only hear you but not see you. It does not matter if you wear a wooden camo or a digital camo in urban areas. However, the warfare scenario changes in the battlefield where terrain is either mountainous, desert, woodland or snowy. This is where a good camouflage plays a vital role in concealing. Militaries across the world is moving towards disruptive digital patterns in camouflage uniform from traditional organic patterns. Indian Army adopted its new digital disruptive pattern in camouflage uniform on 15th January 2022 during the Army Day Parade. The Indian Army's new combat uniform was designed by National Institute of Fashion Technology NIFT. The Indian Air Force's new combat uniform also seems to have elements borrowed from the uniform of Indian Army. It has been customized as per conditions and requirement of Indian Air Force down personnel. The colors and shades of the new uniform is also a little different and more conducive to the Air Force working environment. The digitally camouflage uniform of Air Force will replace the existing Indian Army green uniform worn by the Indian Air Force personnel while discharging their ground duties in an operational environment. These new prints, fabric and design of the uniform are developed to maximize the operational efficiency of the Indian Air Force ground personnel for all terrain and all season. The Indian Air Force Garud Special Forces will use camouflage uniforms akin to the Indian Army. The fabric of the new uniform is also more lighter and sturdier, making it comfortable to wear for longer duration. The digital camouflage of the uniform makes it suitable for different terrains including desert, woodland, mountainous and urban landscapes without detection. The other major highlight of the uniform is the field scale disruptive cap, combat boonie hat, disruptive web belt, anklet combat boots and matching turban. The other major announcement made by Chief of Air Staff was regarding the weapon system branch for officers in the Indian Air Force. In a historic step for Indian Air Force, government has approved the creation of new branch called the weapon system branch. The creation of weapon system branch would entail unification of all weapon system operators under one entity dedicated to the operational employment of all ground based and a special airborne weapon system. The branch would encompass operators in four specialized streams of surface-to-surface -surface missile, surface-to-air missiles, remotely piloted aircraft and weapon system operators in twin or multi-crew aircraft. The branch will contribute immensely by enhancing the warfighting capability of the Indian Air Force. It will also save government more than 3,400 crore rupees due to the reduced expenditure on flying trainings. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We'll soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.